isn't it? The Radio Whammo Breakfast. The view from Ariel L's place. Mr. Eero Soul himself. I'm trying to. I'm still trying to work out that uh, that match up there, mate. Please, Eero, please, please, Ariel. Oh, oh Eero, you get it. Eero, get it. Yeah, yeah you got it. You get it. Going, go, you briefly. Yeah. Mm. How are you, Whammo? I don't know. I'm trying to link one thing to the next, to the next, to the next. A flow, you know. I'm trying to get the flow. Uh, yeah, well, it is, it is Monday morning, so you know, don't get too, don't get too carried away. You sort of can get away with it for a wee while. Yeah. Hey, how was your weekend? Weekend was fantastic. Actually, thanks for asking. Um, what, what happened? It was well, it's sort of like someone put this biosphere over Canterbury, and as much as the rest of the uh, the rest of the you know country was being you know howled and bowled and blown around, Canterbury had sort of relatively nice weather, and we had uh, you know sunshine and all sorts of bits and pieces. Not too much extreme. When I think it was, I think you could call it, say we were in the eye of the storm. I'd say so because it was nuts up north and nuts down south. Yeah, nuts all around the place, and yeah, it was a, a pretty pretty bit of carnage actually. You know, Stadium Southland. You know, there is another a, a major tragedy of, a, of, a, of a, a tennis arena roof caving in under snow, and still no one gets hurt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, the, when I first heard about it, I, was, uh, I thought, what? The roof caved in? Don't they expect snow in Invercargill? Yeah, well, one would expect so, wouldn't they? But um, obviously, I think it was a, a mixture of a lot of heavy, damp snow, or, or I don't know, it'll, it'll come out in the news probably tonight, so we can we can check that one. But I must I must admit, mate, that, you know, I know we've talked about this quite a bit, but last night at about twelve thirty, I thought there was I thought there was a train coming through the house again, Wemmer. Oh, really? Oh my goodness me! It was it was one of the, it was it wasn't so much a rocky one; it was a noisy one. It was sort of like rocks were hitting up against the side of the uh, side of the house. So um, I'm not quite sure what's going on out there. Out there. But I'd say something went. Actually, I drove through Horrorati here today. Yeah. Went up the mountain and had a beautiful day up the mountain, but he doing a bit of powder riding and everything. And so I went and checked out the St John's Church, which is right in the heart of the epicenter. Oh my goodness me! Talk about a mess. Yeah. Have they got yeah. some tarps on that thing? No, mate. That is no. Nah, she's coming down, baby. Oh no. Yeah, she's all going on. But a few other things going on. Um, are you on? Where am I? It's a big week in Auckland this week, as you probably well, you may not know, or you may know. It's it's it's, it's Fashion Week. Of course. And are you on the list? That's oh, what I want to know. Always. I should be what, somewhere sitting next to the catwalk, dark glasses on. How many shows have you been invited to? A little goodie bag. How many shows have you been personally invited to, Wemo? A massive sum of zero, oh very goodness. well. You could te- technically say you're not on the list. I'm not really known as the, the local fashionista. Oh, mate. Well, it's basically the week of smoke and mirrors and everyone's who's who and who's not down the viaduct. And... Are, are you going to be there? Oh. I might come on Wednesday. You get invited. Well, I don't know why, but um, no, I thought I might come to you know. But I, you know, it's it's, it's my whole theory for this year, Wemo. The best way to survive a storm is not be in it. True. Yeah, so it's sort of. Uh, but I might pop up on Wednesday, see what happens. But you know, we're getting pretty excited down here for the mayoral elections. Well, yeah, likewise in, in in Auckland as well. But um, but yeah, the the the, the Christchurch one is interesting. It is. We've um, got. We've got an ex-media personality, Mr. Bob Parker, yeah. who uh, who's basically out there. Who and uh, this is a pretty funny quote, actually. Um, Jim Anderson, who obviously is, is is running for the gun as well, was um, he was quoted prior earthquake down here that it would take a major disaster. No, no, he didn't. For, for, for Jim, oh, he didn't. No, oh, oh, no, we, that was that was put out there by. Um, I don't want to give away his website, but if people know who Cameron Slater is, it was put out by him, and it was um, they they fiddled his words. He was actually talking about something that happened in the eighties. Some I don't know some some it was some, something back in the eighties anyway, something political back in the eighties, and then they just j- mashed the the two pieces together to make it look like he was talking about Bob Parker. Oh, spin part. It's been, it's, oh, was it was it spin mongering? Yeah. Oh, good. Well, in that case, we won't get into that one then. But I did think to myself, imagine if Bob Parker lost. And then, you know, further, because he has done a few good things. If, 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 if it got to the stage of someone that this is your life, Bob Parker, could he present the show himself? Oh, well, I'm, well he did apparently. If there's one other website out there, then people oh, might, might want right to check out. If you, if you just Google Bob, Bob Barker caused the Christchurch earthquake. Um, I saw that one. <laughs> he cloned himself at some point on Banks Peninsula when he was mayor out there. Yeah, yeah. So he could potentially, yes, host his own This Is Your Life Bob Parker show. Well, I, I heard a rumour the other day that his, he, he, Bob's actually morphed himself into his wife and he's actually now walking around as his girlfriend. <laughs> How about that one? So the real Bob Parker doesn't actually exist. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> Enough of this refresh. <laughs> this is great. But, you know, That's but, brilliant. But, but, but sticking up for Jim for a second, 
you know, he has got a couple of good arrows in his belt, you know, the whole Kiwi Bank thing and other things like that. So yep. it'll be interesting to see which way the cry... I, I got a voting... I got a, I got one of those voting forms the other day, and there it is, all the people that are going for mayor, and I'm like, holy smoke, I didn't even know about half of these guys. And, There's a bunch you know, of them. And then it comes to, like, who do you elect for the, for the, the you know, the, the hospital board and all that sort yeah, of that's, stuff. Yeah, that's... Oh, man, that's, that's, that's just... Yeah, play, that's by numbers, isn't it? That's it's, any, it's, many, money mo. It's definitely that. one of those classic ones where you get the pen, you draw it on the paper yeah. and good luck to whoever you know fell, fell away. Yeah, because it's hard enough deciding the mayor, and then you get asked to vote all these other people. And it's like, what? I oh, know, and, and usually you'll have the attitude, don't vote, it only encourages them. And they're like, oh, <laughs> God, what do you do? That's such a dad thing to say, don't vote, it only encourages them. <laughs> don't vote, it only encourages them, makes them think you actually care. <laughs> On that note, Ariel, cheers very much. Well, um, oh, by the way, by the way, last week, did you um, did you go and check out the new hot springs that have opened up? No, I didn't go and dig my hole. Okay, right. No, that was that was a bit of a no, but uh, but I must admit, I've, I'm heading that way in the next couple of days. So pop me that question next week. Okay, good. Well, I might see in the front row at, at um, oh yeah, fashionless week. Drop by Kiwi if you get to get an opportunity. Oh, I'll pop in for a quiet one. Yeah, it sounds Is that good. Kiwi cafe across the road still open. Yeah, it's still there. Oh, good Go to see. It's pretty hard to find a good cafe in Christchurch at Come the on. moment. Come knock on the door. Okay, knock, knock. Okay, see you. Okay, bye. bye.